Well, it's still one day until April Fool's, but a group of people have pulled off a prank meant to, in this case, stimulate the economy. It's like those famous flash mobs, but this time the party starts when the money comes out. News 13 Scott Daniels is live in the Newsplex to explain. Scott? Dean, the goal is to choose a store and get the entire group to meet there and start buying. Dozens poured into the St. Vincent de Paul thrift store in Northeast Albuquerque. Hi, how you all doing today? Their mission, to shop like the local economy depends on it. The group formed through Facebook after seeing successful cash mobs done in different states. ABQ Cash Mob's creator wanted to hit stores that were hurt from the poor economy. Ooh, there you go. This nonprofit has been doing well since it opened its doors last month, but they help people who are poor. I think this business is one of the best starting places for this um, because it really fully encompasses all what this is about. With items for all shapes and sizes, a little extra cable for the house. Friends and families went out to shop locally, filling the store. The mob came armed with shopping carts and some dough. We said about $10, just, you know, thrift store, lots of good little things that they can buy for about $10. The group knows the money they spend will stay in the local economy, so a record that's simply irresistible not to have for a collection like Robert Palmer here will help pay for a good cause. In the Archdiocese of Santa Fe, we help people with their rent, utilities, food, clothing, furniture. Laverne Armijo from St. Vincent de Paul says the extra help from perfect strangers will make it easy for donations to grow. So $200 could easily help two or three families. The thrift store made more than $300 from the cash mob. The group also went out to a local restaurant and hopes to do the same there. Dean, back to you. All right, Scott, thank you. And that cash mob, by the way, wants to keep the experiment going. They are planning to do one of these every month, hitting locations all around Albuquerque.